For sale at Boyd's Brass is another iconic Elkhart Con 8D French horn. This is an N-series model and is really a transition horn. It's not made in Elkhart, but the parts were, uh, especially the bell and the valves were Elkhart made and then trucked to Abilene where they were assembled. It's considered a transition horn. The make and construction of these transition horns is very good. This one in particular is excellent. It was rebuilt by Chuck Ward in Cleveland, Ohio. The valves were redone, so they have perfect compression. And he also put a new bell tail on this horn, cut the bell, and then was able to use the original bell flare. So this flare is original to the horn, but the tail is not. It's a new uh, Eastlake bell. The bell tail is not original, like I mentioned, but it is an Eastlake bell and is a very well made. It's not extra heavy. It fits the horn well, and uh, I've played a lot on this horn, and I don't feel like it takes away from it being an Elkhart to have the Eastlake bell on it. I think it's a good addition, and Chuck really did a good job fitting it to the horn. So now we're going to take a look at the back of the horn. Uh, I do want to point out that the lead pipe has been replaced. Uh, the original was, one was damaged, but it was well replaced again by Chuck. And he did a good job with that. I believe it's off an Elkhart horn, but I'm not sure of that. He also installed a Amato water key and also had to put a patch right here. So, of course, that patch, very well done. Uh, Going to be just fine. If you don't like this patch, pull the slide out and replace it. But uh, really, that's not hurting how the horn plays at all. Uh, he really did a good job with that. Really, this is a great professional horn. Uh, ready to be played by a serious student or even in professional orchestra. Mm -hmm.